Most of the cars that come through these garage doors are total piles of junk. This is it. The newest throttle project is here, boys. Is that a 300ZX? But 700 bucks. Same owner for the past. But when this Evo arrived, it was actually in really good condition. We just picked up this absolute cream puff of a 2003 Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 8. Cream oh, puff? It is, look at it, it's in such good what shape. What does that even mean? After a thorough inspection of the car, we found zero major issues. All it needed was a little basic maintenance. Even though our little cream puff here was in excellent shape, we couldn't leave it stock. We added a new exhaust system, coilovers, refreshed the Brembo brakes, slapped on some new wheels, and sent it off to Torrey Pines Collision to fix all of the imperfections in the paint. Oh man, this looks like a brand new car. The reason we want this Evo to be perfect is because we're actually giving it away to one of you guys. So head over to Thrall.com to find out how you can make this Evo yours. We're gonna be using the Dry Ice Energy Champ Vario to dry ice blast the entire underside of this car, get all of the old road grime off and make it look brand new. This machine plus thousands of other detailing products have just been added to the Throttle website. So check out the link in the description. Oh yeah. I think the first hit's gonna be like right there. Dry ice blasting is a quick and easy cleaning method to remove years of road grime that's built up on the underside of your car. Once you have the machine hooked up to an air compressor, all you have to do is fill it with dry ice pellets. These dry ice pellets blast the underside of the car and easily remove dirt from metal or rubber parts. The dry ice blaster is also perfect for reaching places that are nearly impossible to clean otherwise. I love how it just brings the color back to everything. Look at this. Right here, look at this. Get a good before shot of that. This little bracket tree right there, you ready? Yeah. Brand new, dude. Literally brand new. Oh, dry ice blasting is so good. I'm excited for this. From that, from that yeah. to that is insane. In like 30 seconds. I know. Too. Yeah. Wait, is this a scope? It's a light. <laughs> yeah, I was saying he looks sniping. like the yeah. uh, the Olympics guy. Yeah. <laughs> The undercarriage of the Evo is complete. What do you think, Evan? Dude, this is like a brand new Evo. It's been 21 years since this yeah. car came out. It does not look like it. All the aluminum cleaned up really nice. The aluminum and the zinc parts are always my favorite to have, like these little brackets, all the little clamps that they use, everything just comes back to life. I love what it does to like the transfer case, all the aluminum housing, the casings, the transmission, all the zinc bounces right back, dude. And just seeing the color the come back. Though? The speed though come out really, yeah. really nice. The rubber, like you can hit everything with it. You just blast it all. All right, we're gonna bring the car down. We're gonna check the engine bay since we have the ice and we have the machine ready to go. Might as well see if we can clean something in there. It actually it doesn't look that dirty in there. No, it already looks pretty good. Maybe this so, right here. This kind of making like the rear firewall back yeah, there, like the ABS, like the engine mirror, like this stuff. Yeah. That's what I was, that's the only thing I could see. Mm -hmm. And that's just dusty, it's not even like dirty. Oh, no. Everything out there looks really good.
The engine bay is 100% complete on the Evo. We didn't really have to do that much rise blasting to it because Ricky and I had already cleaned everything inside of here. It was just the little tiny things that we couldn't really get to, like polishing the intake manifold or getting all these little brackets, like these brackets cleaned up super nice. And all the kind of little zinc finishing touches stuff, we couldn't get with just a pressure washer. So that really dialed it in. Dude, this car is like brand new. So sick, but so good. remember this? Yeah, who did that? Oh uh, yeah, no, it showed up like that. Was it like that already? Yeah, that's or why we ordered a whole another that. one. So we are gonna be replacing this and we have a couple more things that are going on in the car before this car is 100% done, but we're almost there. Let's go on. This engine bay looks so new. It's about to look even more new, new. And you know what's crazy? In the box, the other piece was not there. He it was it packaged in. broken already. Look at that. I got in a big chunk. That's how it showed up. It. Done. Peace. Yeah. And these, like, like, I'm already bending it with my hand. Damn, Ricky. I'm literally watching it bend. Oh, God, that is bending. You better bring the impact gun. It's gonna be a wrench. It's gonna go like this. This is cool right here. Hey! Damn, I just cleaned this bar too. <laughs> right. right. Ooh, oh my God! It's so blue, good. baby. Yeah, boy. Oh, that's solid. Nice. Yeah, it's, it's, not, it's not. Bending you, it you no, no, it's not bending at all. No, 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 it's not bending. Look at that. Sheesh. <laughs> All right, we have one more bar. Queen thinks he knows where it goes. Look at him, look at him, look at him. <gasps> you do know. Look, should have used the impact. Oh, God. Oh, he's gonna Impact ain't gonna do nothing. He's gonna. What? Don't you dare talk crap on the <laughs> impact. Ah, it's because my battery's dead. Don't do that. Grab a half inch. No. You're gonna break that. Oh, my God. He's gonna break. You're gonna break it. He broke it. I broke that bolt. Dude. No. Oh God. Quinn. Tools are meant to be used, brother. It's meant to be used, not abused. Ooh, yes, sir. What up, my boy? here. You okay? Yeah, I'm all right. Holy crap! I think right? I choked on that Reese's. I almost gave you CPR. You almost killed me! No. Yeah! You caught it. No, inside. What? Oh <laughs> my <laughs> god. Yeah, go drink water. Alright, since Vic is dying over there, I guess we got this. Can you not get it in? You know what will help the gun? Boom. There you go, see? You go, torque to spec, huh? Oh yeah, woo! Ricky spec. Torque to Ricky spec. All right, Evo's done, baby! Let's go, baby. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, this is the last time that we're gonna drive this car before we give it away. Oh. We're gonna make sure that everything is sound, like there's no extra clinking and cankling. Extra what? Uh, here we go. There we go. Oh, jeez, dude. <laughs> <laughs> she handles. Dude, that's good. Bro, you gotta prep me for that. I said, here we go. I literally said, here we go. <laughs> that doesn't that mean anything. It. I think she's ready, man. I think she is. Dude. I think she's 100% done. She's 100% ready for the new owner. If you didn't know, this car can be yours and an extra $20,000 in cash. All you gotta do is go to throttle.com. Every dollar you spend gets you one entry to win this beautiful car. Did you say an extra $20,000 in cash? Yeah. It's and $20,000 in cash. Well, if you think about it, you get the car. And on top of that, you get an extra $20,000.
got to head back to the shop. Why, Ricky? Because Yu Yang is on his way to pick up the A90 Super. I'm excited to see that car go. Let's get back to the shop, baby. A90 Supra is our 25th car giveaway that we've done. I think we've given away like a million dollars in cars at this point. One million dollars. All right, Ricky, three, two, one. What's your favorite, your favorite car we've ever given away? The Evo 8, the blue one. That's one of my top ones and the uh, E92. Ooh, going R35. 08 STI hatch. Probably the orange 240SX. Second choice Mustang. Ooh, MR2. Welcome, congrats. So you ever driven a Supra? Yeah. No? Yeah. Come on yeah. in, it's our winner right here. What's under there is what you're most interested in, yeah? <laughs> what did you buy to get the entries in to win the Supra? Mono wheel. Yeah, Momo, uh, Monte Carlo, CEO, yeah, yeah, yeah. which is a good choice. Yeah. But I think you were pretty surprised when we called you, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> shot. So what, what did you put the steering wheel on? Or have you not installed it yet? Actually, the gift. The gift? Yeah. Wow, that's cool. Five, four, three, two, one. I'm coming to the car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll start it up. Yeah. See how it sounds. Oh yeah. Yeah, let's go. Can I hug you? Congrats, man. <laughs> I know it probably doesn't feel real yet, but it's real. It's go for a ride. Go for a ride. Actually, I talked to my uh, all my friends that I probably like. Uh, want to sell one of my car to buy yeah. one Supra. Really? You were thinking about sending one of your cars to buy a Supra? That's insane. Now you don't have to sell anything. Yeah. Why do you like so much about the Supra that you wanted to buy one? It's so fast on the track. Is it? Yeah. Okay, I, I've, I've never tracked one, so I don't know. Yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, he's testing it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my boy. <laughs> How is it? Amazing. Now, are you planning on like tracking this thing, daily driving? What, what is your plan? Or you don't uh, know? I probably get a daily drive for yeah. a month, and okay. uh, I will take it to track either next month. Nice. Probably Lacuna. The deal is done. Yu Yang, you're now the new owner of a Super, and you got your check right there. Hey, don't show them the number. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, you got the keys. Yep. Congrats. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Enjoy it. Thank you. All right, Evo sweepstakes is almost over. So at the end of the month, September 30th, that's gonna be the close of the Evo sweepstakes. Please check out the website. We've been working really hard. We're getting our merch program back in action. We dropped a ton of new merch, new gear, so you guys have something cool to wear. And uh, I really appreciate anyone who's picked anything up. Um, and good luck for anyone who's got those entries in to win EVO. So I wanted to end this video a little bit different and kind of just have an honest conversation with you guys about what do you guys want to see us build next and give away as our next giveaway car. So we have built so many cars. Uh, this was our 26th giveaway. We've done like a million dollars in prizes at this point. We've given everything away from a GTR, Mustang, uh, Supras, WRXs, Evos, multiple Evos at this point. And I wanted to ask you guys for a favor, which is please comment down below what kind of car do you want to see us build and give away to you guys. And I did want to also preface, the Evo was a little bit different. We did a more restoration style build, a more OEM plus style build, not a lot of custom mods or anything that was overly aggressive. We wanted to make sure this thing was um, cool to drive in any state. It's not too low. Uh, it's not too loud, and we just tried to make it more OEM plus. I think personally, that's like my favorite style, and I think it's the most usable, but we also know some people have crazier styles. You guys wanna see us do more wide bodies, maybe more bags, maybe we do audio systems or crazy body kits, I'm not sure. And I want to hear you guys in the comment section below, and we do read the comments too. Um, so I see a lot of comments every day, and we try to respond to as many as we can, but we do read 
almost every single one on every single episode. So please be vocal in the comment section down below. So that brings up another question. You know, should we go outside the box? Maybe you guys would like to see us build a truck and give it away. Or maybe we do a truck and trailer. Or maybe we do like a throttle experience where you can come out to throttle for a whole week, spend some time with us here, maybe get a park shopping spree. I don't know. I am down to try anything that you guys find interesting. So I'd love to hear some creative ideas and please use that comment section or if you're not comfortable making a public comment, please shoot me a DM on Instagram or the Throttle account. The other thing I wanted to mention is please keep in mind we live in California. The cars that we build and give away are 100% 50 state legal. So we can't do anything that is not 50 state legal. We wanna make sure whoever wins the car or truck for that matter, uh, can drive it and register in their state without any problem. So that's why you guys see us probably not doing a ton of engine mods um, is because we wanna do everything by the book and we wanna make sure that someone can take home a car from us and just enjoy it. One other crazy idea I have, and I'll leave you with this, is what do you guys think about taking home a throttle car or a project that's already been completed on the channel? So I don't think we've really ever done that. Would you guys be interested if we did a Fox Body sweepstakes? Or would you be interested if we somehow did the Super sweepstakes? Um, I have no idea. We've never really talked about it, but as we grow and as we evolve, um, I'd be down to entertain some kind of crazy ideas. And just know that anything that we do with these cars, we reinvest into making the sweepstakes better, the projects better, the content better, and it's free for you guys. It is free for you guys to watch all of our content and we wanna keep it that way forever. And uh, we have a ton of fun doing it. But as you guys can probably tell by the past couple videos, we really don't have a lot of space here. And maybe it's time to say goodbye to some of the projects that have been with us for a long time that we truthfully just don't have a lot of content to make with them. So, you know, for those who don't know, everything on YouTube has a lifespan. Cars are built, they're used, then they're no longer of use to us if we can't make videos on them. And no one really wants to see us take on another build series with a car that's been built two, three, four times before. So I'm gonna leave you guys with that. I just wanna say thank you guys so much for supporting us. Thank you for getting those entries in to win the Evo. We have a ton of new stuff, like I said, and I'm just really excited. I have an idea, the next sweepstakes is going to be crazy and I really wanna hear from you guys. I want you guys to be stoked about it. And I cannot wait to see you guys in the next episode. So we'll see you guys later. Peace out. See you in the next one.